Hi, I'm Jen Hitt, and I am raising funds to help finish up my full-length album, Amphibious Heart, songs about the mystery of love. Keep me up all night long, let me sleep past the dawn. Stir my heart with a coffee spoon, tell my eardrums not to swoon, good luck, fat chance, when that scorpion stings, oh it stings fast. For a little less than a decade, I worked for NPR station WAMU, and so I thought, who better to interview me about this project than radio host Jen Hitt. In the studio with me today, an up-and-coming music maker. She lives in Austin, Texas, but spent many years living in Washington, D.C. Please welcome Jen Hitt. Thanks so much. You have a new album coming out in the fall, your first full-length studio album, 11 songs on the mystery of love. Tell me a little bit about how you brought these songs together. Well, I, a lot of these songs started in 2013, started writing them then as part of the Song of the Month Club. It's a group of patrons who donated a little bit to keep me in the writing process. And then we recorded about 11 of those songs that were written over the course of two years. And the producers, Grant Johnson, Christopher Cox, um, AKA Fat Fuse Music, they were the ones actually that picked out the theme of the mystery of love. So um, it just kind of evolved out of the music and out of the two year writing process. Sounds like a great environment to be in in Austin, Texas. Who else were you able to work with on this album? Oh, so many talented people. It was really a pleasure. Matt Shepard played drums. Christopher Cox, the producer, he did a lot of synth work and also electric bass. Andrew Pressman came in and did one stand-up bass track. We had a cello played by Diana Burgess of Mother Falcon. Um, three talented vocalists joined me, Casey Lung, Debbie Cerrone, and April Frederick. And let's see who else. Oh, of course, the incomparable Wilson Marks played the guitar. We had Christina Lanuza play the harmonium. And I, of course, played guitar and piano and sang. You know, the sound on this album is very different from your 2012 EP called Tonight. That was distinctly Americana. This one feels more... How would you describe the sound? Yeah, the songs themselves really required a darker style, maybe almost psychedelic with some synthesizers and electric guitars. But there's always an acoustic anchor of a, a acoustic guitar sound, a piano sound, something organic in the mix. What track do you think would be a good example of this darker direction that you're going in. The darkest would be the title track, Amphibious Heart. I'm so proud of the way this song turned out, thanks to Grant and Chris and everyone involved. is in the studio with me and she is raising funds to complete this album on Indiegogo about five thousand dollars what still needs to be done the biggest expense that is left is the professional mastering that's the engineering process where the song gets set up to be heard on CD or radio or digitally there is a commissioned piece of art coming in amphibious heart from Grace Park she's a amazing artist and musician she plays with the deer 
There is the graphic design, the liner notes. There's the physical goods, the CDs, and also a little bit of publicity and distribution costs. And much like public radio fund drives, you're offering thank you gifts for people who donate. Indiegogo calls them perks. Uh, what are some of the perks that you're offering for this campaign? You can pre-order the album itself. Um, there are some pencils that have lyrics engraved. We've got matches and lots of hand-painted items, some journals and art. Um, I also found this new style pint glass that has a curved rim. So when you drink and your lip sits on it, it's extremely comfortable. Very comfortable to drink out of. And um, there are yoga and music experiences at the higher donation level. But whatever level that you can donate to, I am just so thankful for everything that everybody has done for me in this long process of making my first album. I truly understand that it takes a lot of people to make it happen and I cannot do it without you. So thank you so much. So